Now, former Vice President Mike Pence is changing his mind, saying he will now comply with a grand jury subpoena to testify in a federal probe into the January 6th riots at the U.S. Capitol. ABC's Justin Finch reports. This morning, former Vice President Mike Pence appearing poised to provide documents and testimony in the Justice Department special counsel probe into January 6th. That day, a mob scouring the Capitol for Pence as former President Donald Trump pressured him. Trump's attorneys fought to block Pence's compliance with the special counsel subpoena, arguing executive privilege. Pence at first openly resisting. I will fight the subpoena from Biden's DOJ. Then telling ABC's Jonathan Carl last month. I'm going to stand firm on the Constitution of the United States. We'll let the courts sort that out. Now, Pence's office saying he will not appeal the judge's ruling and will comply with the subpoena as required by law. A subpoena that could position Pence as a star witness in the special counsel investigation into alleged efforts by Trump and allies to overturn the 2020 election results. Pence questioned by ABC's David Muir. Did you ever point blank say to the president, I will not do this, I will not intervene, we lost this election? I did, David, many times. Fast forward to this week, Trump arraigned on 34 felony counts in connection to a hush money payment scheme involving adult film actress Stormy Daniels just before the 2016 election. Trump now the focus of a series of crucial inquiries, a Georgia grand jury election interference probe and two in New York State, one alleging fraud at the Trump organization and the other investigating money laundering at his truth social platform. As for Pence, his testimony could be weeks away unless Trump's lawyers try again to block it. Pence's team says he will comply with the court's decisions. Justin Finch, ABC News, Washington.